Dogs, 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 big dogs, little dogs, everywhere you look, there's a dog. We're at the 138th annual Westminster Kettle Club Dog Show here in New York City. Well, this is Heather Bailey all the way from Louisiana with a, uh, a new, uh, the, the Rat Terrier, which, which has just been accepted into the Kennel Club uh, dog show here. Yes. Tell, tell me a little bit about uh, this winner. This is a little girl. She won reserve winner's bitch here at the Westminster Kennel Club. And uh, it's just an awesome experience to be part of the first breed that, you know, our first time here and the first uh, initial for the breed and everything. Uh, it took us three days to get here, and um, we're enjoying the city. She's adapted really well, and um, very proud of how she's done today. So uh, she'll be happy to get back home and hunt her rats in the field, but she's adapted very well here. So she's a hunter. She's very much a hunter. Her, she belongs to a little 12-year-old uh, little boy named Travis, and they go out in the field and hunt all the time. And so he'll be happy to have his his baby back home so uh, I've had the privilege of showing her for her whole career uh, Cindy and Travis are actually uh, friends of mine for, since high school and um, so uh, it's just an honor to be able to be here with this little girl so she loves to play tennis ball and she's very food motivated she does a little bit of everything she does some obedience and she does some ratting and then of course we do the confirmation here so uh, She's two years old, and she's originally bred out of Texas. Uh, she's a Cohills dog. Uh, her name is Cohills Spotted Eye Candy, and we call her LG, or Little Girl for short. So uh, she lives in South Louisiana, in Lafayette, and uh, just enjoys the swamp and hunting the rats down there. <laughs> <laughs> well, congratulations there. Good luck to you. Thank you very much. Oh. Friendly? Very friendly, yes. She doesn't usually meet a stranger, especially if you have food or a ball. If you've got a tennis ball, she'll play with you all day long. <laughs> oh, okay. Love to remember that. Congratulations, there. Thank you very much. With us is, is Rufus. Rufus is a Sussex Spaniel. And we saw Rufus doing a lot of tricks there. Yes, he likes to do the Sussex hula. <laughs> And how'd you train him to do that? He did it on his own. The breed, some of the breed just does it. Okay. So he's got a broad base and he just likes to sit there when people clap or make a fuss over him, then he does the Sussex hula. Tell me a little bit about the breed. They're uh, a sporting breed and they were bred low because he's long and low to go through the coarse bush when they hunt birds. So they flush birds. And we did really well today. We got Select Dog. Well, congratulations, Rufus. And, and how old did you say? Rufus will be three in May. Good boy, Rufus. Good boy. Can and you and has he done other competitions? Yes, he's a champion, and we just need two more points to be a grand champion. Oh, boy, you are really almost there, Rufus. <laughs> almost. Almost. And, and, and tell me about, um, uh, as far as the maintenance on, on this type of dog. To be brushed a couple times a week because they have real fine hair. So you need to... <laughs> they need to be brushed, oh, at least twice a, a week to keep their coat nice. I would ask if he likes children, but I think the proof is in the pudding right yes, here. Yes, yeah, he loves my grandson. Oh, and he loves grandson? He loves other children, too. Oh. So, and we've taken him hunting. He loves to go and flush grouse and partridge, too. So he's a nice all-around family dog. But he likes the outdoors. He loves the outdoors. He does. We live in Michigan, and he likes to sit out in the cold and snow and wait for birds or deer or something to come by. I think he's really relaxed now. <laughs> oh, he's real relaxed. Well, hey, you deserve it right there. <laughs> All the way from Delaware, we have Donna Turner, and, and I love her because we both are sharing the same jacket, so we, we both have the same taste here. That's right, we do, <laughs> we do. And, and tell me now, this is a German pincher? Yes, it's a German pincher. He's only eight months old, and he's being shown in the bred by exhibitor class because it is now offered. It wasn't until last year. And 
you have to uh, fit certain criteria in order to come and show your dog at Westminster. It has to be a finished champion or else it has to have at least one major win. And when he was only six months old, he won a five-point major, which qualified him to enter. And that's why we're here today. So we're pretty excited. We're pretty excited. Whoops, what you doing, buddy? And, and, and tell me, what was uh, the dog bred for? This dog was bred for, um, they use them on farms for hunting vermin, and they're also for protection. And it's in the working group. This dog is in the working group. Is he friendly? Or He's very friendly. Very friendly? Yes, to a fault. <laughs> well, he needs to protect things, maybe. <laughs> yeah, and they are. They're naturally protective. It's a, it's a great dog in a medium-sized package. And, and tell me about his grooming. Well, it's, he's really pretty easy to groom. We just trim the hair in their ears like a Doberman, and we trim the whiskers off their face and just clean them up a little bit. And pretty much it's a wash-and-go dog, which is great. He likes the outdoors? He does. It, now he needs a coat. It's cold. Okay. Okay? But he's pretty sturdy. He's a pretty sturdy little dog. This is Annie, and she is a Basset Hound, and they are in the Hound Group. Uh, they were originally bred in France to help the common man out and hunt rabbits, and they will actually walk a rabbit to ground. So they're very tenacious, and they're very strong-minded and strong-willed, and they're very, very, very persistent. They make wonderful, wonderful family dogs. They take care of their pack. They're wonderful with kids. Um, I can't think of too many more dogs that would fit in a home like a Basset does. <laughs> They're just absolutely wonderful to have. And now the winner of the 2014 Best in Show went to Skye, a wire fox terrier bred in England to go to ground after fox and small vermin. They have natural hunting and digging instincts and are alert, active dogs, originally bred to be independent hunters. What was it about this moment, this dog, and why did you pick Skye? It's a very difficult decision. It really is because I had seven magnificent animals, and there's always some, some, something very magical that happens. And they make, they stand, they make a pose, and they just—it's theirs. They own it, and it's difficult to explain, hard to put into words, but it's unmistakable. Is it the it factor? It's the it factor. It's the it factor. That's a, that's good. It's the it factor. Absolutely. Absolutely. She was really on, I thought. I've seen her show before. She was really, she was really on. And I'm Crystal Hart reporting from the 138th Annual Westminster Kennel Club Dog Show here in New York City. Hope you've enjoyed the show. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.